Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it is a collaboration with Mama Schmooze. And myself and a few other YouTube mommies are going to be doing a video on how to stay sane and happier as a mom. <laughs> Stay tuned for that. Now before we go into the video, if you are new to my channel, hello, I'm Valerie. Please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and give this video a thumbs up. Okay, so let's get into the video. Okay, so how to stay sane and happier as a mom. Here are a few things that I do to help me stay sane, to help me just be a happier mom, a more productive mom, just helps me to regroup and come back and just embrace the chaos, I guess you could say. Okay, so number one is just being able to shower on a daily basis is important for me. It just helps me to clear and wash away all of the day's things that have happened, whether they're good or bad, right? So being able to shower is definitely important for me to stay sane. Number two, being able to eat at least one meal on my own. Yes. Um, so for me, it's usually during nap time. I like to be able to eat on my own while my son is sleeping. Number three is play dates and or play groups. This just helps me to be able to interact um, with other moms. So to get that adult interaction, I'm a very much social type of person. So I really enjoy it. And then my son also gets a chance to interact with other kids. So it's a win-win situation there. Number four, getting out of the house daily. I need to get out of the house at least once a day, even if it's just to go to the library or to take a walk around the mall, not necessarily to buy anything, just take a walk around the mall um, or pick up a pretzel or something like that. But I need to get out of the house at least once a day and so does my son now. I think he's pretty much picked that up from me. And the last thing, number five, it's going to be prayer and or like a Bible study, whether it's on my own or in a group. So before I used to do Bible studies on my own, I have like a 365 day type of devotionals type thing. And I used to read that on my own and do prayer. And then um, now I'm doing a women's Bible study once a week. And so there I get to kind of, again, do that adult interaction. And also my son gets to be with other kids um, in the nursery area. So it just kind of helps to bring that peace back into my life. And it's just something that I enjoy. It just helps me to regroup. So those are five ways that I stay sane and happier as a mom. Um, for all of you first time moms, I'm actually a first time mom myself. Um, I guess my best advice to you would be just take those few moments to find that time for yourself. I know that in the beginning, especially when the babies are infants, it's a little bit harder and you're just unsure of how to do certain things at first. But, you know, even if you can just, again, take that shower on your own, you'll just feel so much better. So if someone can take that baby for you for just that half an hour that you might need um, or while your baby is napping, you know, I know they say nap too, so definitely if you can, do take that nap or eat your lunch on your own, that kind of thing. So that would be my best advice for you, is just find those few minutes to just keep you happy and keep you sane as a mom. That's pretty much all I have for today's video. So I hope you enjoyed it, and please leave in the comments down below how do you stay sane and how do you stay happy as a mom, whether you're a first time mom or you have a couple of babies. <laughs> okay, well, until the next video, YouTubers, bye!